Um, thank you very much, Bob. Um, we joined the business just over three and a half years ago. Um, what to say? Um, my own business as a coach and trainer, I worked in the, my life has always been personal development and uh, I worked mainly within uh, multinationals. So after the birth of my second daughter, a business I'd spent 10 years building up that I believed was successful had effectively disappeared overnight. Um, circumstances had changed though and I was a mum of two. So my priorities had changed. I didn't work for a year and in that year I didn't earn. Um, we went from a household of two good incomes down to three quarters of an income, and that really hurt. Um, so when Forever came along, I was looking for something. I had no idea what I was looking for. And um, our sponsors, Mary and John Stewart, uh, showed us this business. I'd looked at other multi-level businesses over my 10 years as a self-employed person in the traditional world. Um, I invested in some. Um, uh, Learned a lot, lost a lot. So by the time Forever Living came along, I really believed those things don't work. They say great things, but they don't work. But curiosity got the better of me. So we did our homework and we looked around it. And I know when I said to Gary, I want 368 euro. I said, no, please, not another one. I said, seriously, this one, we have to do this one. And I can remember the conversation very clearly. Um, my gut, my absolute gut said, I always believed that residual income was the way to go, that that was the way that was going to change our lives. Um, I'm not very good with figures. Don't put me in a stock exchange. I might as well stand out in the field. Um, I really don't have a clue. Um, I'm not going to write a book. Um, you don't want me to sing a song. So royalty, you know, I, how can you do it? But the, that's, how you, that's what multi-level is about as far as I, we're concerned. It's about the residual earning. Um, I never ever wanted to be or ever will be in the position ever again whereby I, if I'm out of work, I don't earn. If I'm not working now, I still earn. We still earn. And each and every one of you have that same thing in your hands. That's what forever living is. When we were in London, um, we had the honor of attending Tom Barrett's, Dr. Tom Barrett's training. He wrote the book, Dare to Dream, Work to Win, which you absolutely have to read. And he said, and it really, really hit home to me, he said, do you realize what you have in your hands? And I sat there and honestly said to myself, do you know what, I don't think I do. So, and I'm three and a half years, two profit share checks later, and you know, I, sometimes you need to just really step back and go, my God, what we have here really, really changes lives. So, in a sense, I feel like I haven't even started. I feel like I've very much been an amateur, um, finding my way, cutting my knees, getting back up again, um, taking the courage to ask people to look at this business when you're absolutely terrified of being judged and being told all the things of why you shouldn't do it. And that I love the people in my business who have that courage. And they give me the courage because I see some people in my business who've been tipping away since the day I started this business and have yet to succeed to the same level. And I know that they're going to. Um, because... <laughs> and I love all those people in my team, in our business, all down our manager lines. Thank you so much for all the work you do. Um, the people who work front line with us, thank you so much for what you do. You inspire me every day, every day I get out of the bed. Sometimes, you know, maybe not with the same spring of my step, and I remind myself that this isn't for me, this is for my family, but this is also for the people in my business who are willing to stick this business out. And success is inevitable in this business because failure doesn't like persist persistence. So just be persistent. And I say that not so much, not as much for every, all the new people in the room, but also for myself, to remind that if I just stick with this, this is going to deliver us our dreams. And I have really, really big dreams. So. <laughs> <laughs> and why not? Why not? Why dream small when you can dream big? So what? You know, the hell with the rest of the world says be in the 5% of the population that says you can have your dreams. So, um, anything else? Um, you have to absolutely master your thinking first in order to become a, a master of a new way. 
So change your thinking and everything will change. And every day be really disciplined about listening to the voice inside in you that encourages you, not the voice inside that says you can't do it because that voice, you know, it's just throw it out. It's no good, get rid of it. So thank you to all the people in our business. Thank you. And I really, really, with all my heart and soul, want to see you guys up on stage. Um, thank you to our sponsors. Um, at the end of the day, someone has to show you this business. So you have to go out there and find that diamond. I think as Bob said earlier on, the diamonds aren't even in the company already, he reckons. So maybe the one I see on Monday might just be that diamond. So thank you. And I think I better pass you over to Gary. Thank you. Right, what can I add to that? Well, Sinead has thanked our team, and I would like to actually thank Sinead. Um, this is our second check, and this one actually means more to us than the previous one. Um, we achieved things last year that we didn't think were possible. And any of you that are sitting here today seeing these checks go across the stage, I encourage you to put this incentive onto your goal list and to go for it. It's not necessarily about the check, it's about the journey. Um, we're still very new in this business and we learn each and every day. And the learnings that we got from getting this, doing this incentive last year, were beyond anything that we've had to date. And that, that's the most important thing that I can say to you. It's put it on, go for it, aim for it. Everybody in this room can achieve one of these checks, and that's what we want to see. For we want to see more than 14 checks walking across that stage next year. Um, it's it's a big trip, and we want loads of Irish with us. So, my advice: all of you go out, go for it.